Hi all, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to discuss another example of grouping. This is our input payload. So as you can see, we have information about the department and the person details. So here Sam works in marketing department, Samara works in sales department and Tom works in marketing department. Now the output payload that we need is something similar to this. Here you can see we need departments as the root node and then it will have the department name and under department it should have the person who are working in that particular department like Sam and Tom both are working in marketing and for sales it's only Samara. Now let's go to our Excel. Now first uh, I'm going to modify some of the code. So I'm deleted some of the parts. First uh, I'm going to match with this root node. And then here as you can see straight away you can add this node. In the template okay okay uh, now if I go to the JSON first I have already set up the source and target file so let's run this first now expect to see only the department root node so it's coming in the result fine then then we need the department names as we have seen in the expected output file we need the department name so for that we will use the group function so here we can write SSL for each group and we are going to select persons plus person and then the group by would be work so it will be work then department that's the structure we have. Work and department. Now, if I just run this, right? We not see any result. Any change actually in the result? Previous result. Right. So we need to output this group. So we can access this by uh, current grouping key function. So first put this value into the variable. The variable name would be department that stands for department. The variable name would be DBT that stands for department. And then the type will be string. And we are going to select our current grouping key. Then we can add SSL element and its name would be the variable so you can access this way any variable then let's see what's the output now so we got two departments marketing and sales now after that We need the information regarding the person so we can iterate about the current group and then we can just put the okay before iterating over the current group we can add the persons
so because uh, under each group there will be only one person no so so if i just execute this job here we got persons not and after that we have to include so either we can put excel copy because the current group is pointing to person so if we just put copy it's going to output uh, the person note so if i just run this again so we have two person notes under marketing department and one person note under sales department now we just need this to information name and age work department is not required that's why instead of using copy of over note just copy so if, if i just do this this is a copy of and then we are going to select name and then here is a we can going to output a answer yeah so tom sam was in marketing some other works in sales that's all for today thank you